<laughs> How lonely city beachfront. Welcome to the biggest city in all of Alola. Buy your clothes, take pictures, go on the beachfront, meet a slowpoke, jump in the water. That's how holy city. Beach time, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> You've come from Alola from some far, someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola. You give it a try, too. Just like that, Alola. You'll make friends if you say it. Why, thank you, random lady who I've just encountered that I shouldn't be talking to strangers to. I'm level 16, but there's at least 20 hours of gameplay between those levels. Dang. And they're putting you with people like me that, that play that game? That's not cool. That's not cool at all. In the words of Carlito, that's not cool, man. Happen to know if Skyrim requires a separate download? Uh, you know what? I was able to. I didn't download the. I didn't download any software update because I'm not sure if there was one. It, it might have even done a, a an auto update by now. But um, when I was playing on a train where there's no reception, it started the game without having to do an update. Hey, Joey, I thought I recognized the sound of those feet. Such an odd description. Okay. So, what do you think? How old is something, eh? Lola's gotta be the best place to ever live. Oh, yeah. Hey, come in here with me. I've got an idea. Uh, Carlito, whatever happened to that guy? He works the indies. I know that. I speak in the face of people who don't know how to be cool. Hey, miss, is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness, that you get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it's true. We do have a, a special item to go with it. It's our very own Pokefinder. Awesome. Isn't that awesome, Joey? You've got a Pokefinder. So, like, what's a Pokefinder? The Pokefinder is a tool that lets you f take lots of photos. Rotom will help them help point out the places where you'll be able to take photos too. Here, I'll read the instruction manual. Tap R. We know what to do. <laughs> We're gonna skip this. Uh, yeah, we know what to do. It's the Poke Finder. <laughs> the photos you can snap Pokemon with the Poke Finder. They're simply too cute to resist. Excellent. Thank you, sir. I got you, fam. I got you. Joey, how? Did you visit the Tourist Bureau yet? How was it? We got this Rotom Dex upgraded. Now we can take pictures, too. What a wonderful helper you are, Rotom. Hey. Oh. Oh, the photo. That's right. Oh, my heart just dropped. Aw. That photo. Uh, that... No, don't spoil it, Joe. Uh, huh? Huh? <laughs> Was that one for Rotom? Go and put that little trickster back in your bag, Joey, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we take care of our stomachs. Maybe Rotom wanted to get your attention because it wants you to take photos with you. I think I'll stop by the shop apparel, the apparel shop, to do some shopping of my own. Yo, trainer, look what you've got. You lucky kid, if you got a Pokefinder, then I'll get I guess I'll give you a little tip. I don't know why I made him sound like he just came straight out of Brooklyn. See that spot where all the wall is cracked? That's a photo spot right there. Hey, look at that. You got your Rotom is there's trying to tell you you too. Give him a tap, hey! Alright, let's tap Rotom. Firing up the Pokefinder. Hey, circle pad. Oh, it's a Pikachu! Big Pikachu picture! And you can also use the motion control as well. Boom. Can I zoom in on this? No.
Oh, wait, why are you so mad at me? You've taken all the pics you can in one go. Now choose the one photo you want to show off. Zzz. Uh, what photo do we want? <laughs> the one where... Okay, there we go. Huh? I was gonna say, I was like, that. they all look the same. Hell yeah. Seems like you can get version 2 if you get a total of 1,500 thumbs up in your photos. Just a little bit further, kiddo. Don't give up now. Alright, and that's how we take photos with the Pokefinder. Pokemon Snap, brought into this game. I hear it's the best to try photograph Pokemon head on and zoom in as close as possible. If you want to know more about the Pokefinder, well, just keep taking on tons of photos. Oh! Alright, I'm gonna go now, kiddo. Alright. <laughs> Let's go to the shop with Lily. Not bragging, just saying. I had over 1k thumbs up on my first picture uploaded. Not bragging, just saying. Yo, I'm not a good photo taker. I'm not good at anything, if you guys haven't noticed this. Oh, Joey, tell me. Do you pick out all your own clothes? <laughs> My mom does it! <laughs> of course I do. Uh, of course, most people do, don't they? I I've always just worn the clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me. Oh, but that doesn't... That's not why I stopped you. I meant to get to see you. I received it inside the shop, or the apparel shop. I didn't even buy anything, but they said I was the 99,999th customer to visit the store. But I already have the same one, so I thought that maybe you might want it? Okay. It looks like we have something in common now, don't we, Joey? <laughs> Alright, let's go to the apparel shop because, yo. These, these, these clothes. These clothes. We gotta rock something. Can't be wearing the Kevin Owens get up. Alright. Here we go. Let's do this. Let's see. Do we have- Oh, we got mo- We got the bodies! Awesome. What luck? Yo. <laughs> shoot it! Oh no! Dead eye! No! Don't shoot the Pikachu! <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. What do we- What do we got here? This is gonna be the most exciting part. I gotta rock that red- That Alola shirt. What? Hmm. Let's see. We got, oh, we got the print tees. Hmm. I'm a shirt guy. I am definitely a shirt guy, if you guys haven't noticed. But they're all tank tops. Why do they gotta be tank tops? Here we go. We got the tees right here. And uh, the stripes. Nah. Eh, I'm not digging the stripes. I do like my button downs. Maybe we stick to the button downs. Let's go. Let's rock the red. We got the red. Let's go. Get red up in here. All right, what pants we got? These capri pants are killing me, man. These capri pants—they got to go. <laughs> Can I wear some shorts or something? <laughs> oh man, this ain't Zell Final Fantasy Seven uh, Eight right now. All right, this is better than nothing. I think I look classier now in this one than in my Pokemon Sun game. Uh, my socks are my socks. That's whatever. Uh, no shoes available, no bags available. What's this? Oh my god, we got that Bruno Mars get up right now. Hold up. Okay, you amazing. Just the way you are. The way you are. <laughs> no, we're gonna rock our Udahada hat. Alright, here we go. We're good. Oh my gosh. That's right. He's saying some Bruno Mars up in the chat. Hey, there's a teacher. We just whooped your butt. <laughs> At least the switch on the new TV looks sweet. Yo. Jealous. Jealous right now. Greetings. Captain Ema here. So, you spotted me sticking up one of these lovely stickers, have you? What's up with the stickers? Oh yes, this is new. If young trial goers collect these stickers at they tra as they travel and follow the path they indicate, they will quite naturally progress along their island challenge. Really, if I had to describe them, I would say these stickers really save trial goers like you. This is new. Huh. 
but I cannot let my guard down. Those Team Skull Thugs have far too much time on their hands, and they're always trying to get in the way of trainers on their island challenge. I have to keep an eye on them to be sure they, they don't take down any of my stickers. I've actually just had a report that Team Skull was ma seen making trouble around town. I suppose I should go have a look. Well then, young Joey, I hope you have, you'll have a delightful time running about to, ser to search out and collect totem stickers. Okay, you gently peeled off the totem sticker. Man, at least it doesn't leave any glue residue like the Best Buy does with the amiibos on the boxes. Destroys the boxes every time. I, it's super annoying. At least you have a switch. This is true. This is true. All right. So question of the night. Um, I want to at least get off this island. Do you guys want to see Skyrim tonight for a little bit for a Nintendo Spotlight, or should I just keep going with uh, with Pokemon? Because we'll do Skyrim for, like, the first hour of Skyrim. Because I do want to get that Nintendo Spotlight in. I just don't know when I'm going to be able to squeeze it in. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, we got the Pokemon vote. All right, Pokemon. I want to see Skyrim script, but not until you get get off the first island of Pokemon. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, like I want to get off this island. Oh, there's another one. How do I get that? How do I get that? Gotta get through this. I gotta get through this. Boom. Two totem stickers. Hell to the yes. And I think we meet Hau here. How's it, Joey? If you're looking for good eats, you've found them. How, my boy. Plus, Malasada, Malasadas, that's what it was. Oh my gosh. Make your Pokemon like you and affect an affectionate Pokemon are even better, better in battle. Who could resist giving their Pokemon a few pop Malasadas, eh? Just so cute. Yo, 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 yo. Check it. Whenever, wherever we meet you, Team Skull, don't ever greet you. But you just did. You just did. Hey, Macarena, right? Yo, you want to throw us a bone and head over those island challenge amulets right now? Oh, so you're part of Team Skull, huh? All you guys ever do is steal totem stickers and people's Pokemon and get in the way of other people's island challenges. You know it. Yo, 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 check it. We hate the island challenge, yo. And every kid fool even enough to try it. Yo, let's check these fools, bro. Come on, Joey. Let's let's teach these Team Skull jerks not to get in anybody's island challenge. All right, let's, see. let's battle them. Yo, check it how I changed the game with my mad Pokemon skills. We going into battlefield the thrills. Oh, I just finished your rhyme, son. Call me a rapper. Greatest lyricist ever. Just saying. Just saying. Let's go. Team Skull and Grunt, just bring it. Woo! That weak Zubat. Look at that Zubat. That Zubat's waiting to get destroyed by Pope Leo right now. The Pope, let's go. Oh man, you do what you want to do, Joe. Yo! I appreciate you, fam. I just want to make sure I'm putting out feelers. I was putting out feelers just to see if anyone was interested. I'm going to keep going with Pokemon then, if that's the case. I think I'll stop at Champion this time. I don't have the patience to grind 200 losses. Ugh. Dude. I'm sorry. What's funny is, didn't we fight... In Pokemon Sun, didn't we fight um, the Team Skull grunts with me and Ilma, the captain, and then we started doing the trials, right? I normally go for Quentin. Damn. You're like crazy into Splatoon then, Panage, aren't you? I didn't know that. I didn't know that. That's actually awesome. <laughs> Alright, Wingle. Thank you, learn to fly and attack. That's all I wanted from you. You would have been great in that last teacher battle. I'm just saying, just saying. 
No fair, I was playing a different game. Let's get up out of this port B. Nobody has to know about this. We need a whack little enemy lens anyway. Wouldn't even take him if you gave him to us. Bay? Bay? Let's get out of here. Those Team Skull Jerks really must have too much time on their hands, yeah? But keeping other people keeping other people from doing their island challenges isn't just gonna make it like they managed to finish theirs, you know? I already went down to the marina and screamed out over the ocean, Watch out, world! Someday I'm gonna beat even my old Gramps in an all-out serious battle, because I got my my piece in, in without even with losing my battle. And 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 you know what? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep this anyway. This 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 thing because I I beat my alien challenge without freaking doing anything because I'm the grandson of the Kahuna, huh? So maybe I'll go try to find some more totem stickers next. See you around. What a lovely battle you showed us there against Team Skull. My thanks to you and your Pokemon. Why don't I heal your team to express my gratitude? But yeah, didn't we fight with Ca fight him with Captain Ilma? Like, it was Captain Ilma next to us, and he beat the other Team Skull Grunt, and then we beat the other Team Skull Grunt in Pokemon Sun? I must admit, I've been wondering about you since I saw you at the trainer school. Professor Kakui brought you along, and you and your Pokemon seem to defeat our teachers so effortlessly. Very well, then. Allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Sure. Let's go. I'm ready. I'll duke it out. Behold the magnificent Pokemon of the one and only Captain Ema. Ding! I feel like he would have a sparkle in his eye. Um, hello, famous Afterwork Strummer. I will take four orders of Pokemans, please. Four Pokemans coming right up. Sir, can you get the Pokemans? The, the Pack the Chew, the Puka Pooker, the Booger Boogers, and the Ooka Booka Booka Do Maximus. What's going on, dude? Yo. Thank you for the host, by the way, earlier. I appreciate you, fam. Guys, you don't know who Mr. Maximus is. He's the homie. He's a speedrunner. He also streams a lot of Resident Evil games. He's actually going through the Resident Evil series chronologically. He was playing 6 last I caught him. Um, and he's been playing with other people, too, which is really dope. So, if you enjoy these streams here, you will definitely enjoy Mr. Maximus' streams. He is an amazing person and an awesome human being. Hit him up with that follow, guys, and show him some love. Just saying. Just saying. Wow, how did you know my order before I said it? Holy crap! Yo, it's because I know you, and Steamy that tree, thank you for the host, brother man. <laughs> I love you, fam. I love you. Oh, man, those of you jumping in and out, I appreciate you guys. We're playing Pokemon Ultra Sun, just released yesterday. We're still on the first island because I didn't get the stream last night, unfortunately. I was stuck at work until close to midnight. Some people would call that a 7 a.m. to a midnight shift. <laughs> I wish I was joking. But, um... <clears throat> and look at my boy back there. He's just like, yes! Yes! Yeah, he's like Daniel Bryan back there. Just released yesterday, or for some of us, two days ago, because some people got them early. <laughs> I'm not jealous. I'm not hating at all. I'm not hating at all. Oh, man. The Panage, how far along are you? Are you close to Queen or no? 17 hour shift is freaking crazy. More power to you, yo. <laughs> I wish it was the first time I could say that, but it's not. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's switch. Oh, crap. What is it? Smeargle? Oh, golly. I don't even... I... You know what? No. I'm gonna switch out just to heal Popplio real quick. This is gonna be a battle gone bad. I remember I got whooped by Smeargle the first time I played the original Sun. Let's do that. Alright. Let's see what Smeargle's got. Oof! Look at that! <laughs> Destruction! Yep. And we're done. We're done here, Wingle. <laughs> also, we only got two more games left, fam, in the playthrough. Dude, that's awesome. What's next? You got what else besides seven? Seven. 
The final grind from champion to king queen is the worst. Oof. We're talking about the uh, the splat fest, by the way, for those of you who might be lost. <laughs> Umbrella corpse resident, eat resident sleeper. Oh my god. But that's not canon. You don't have to play that. <laughs> oh wait, no. Umbrella corpse is canon. Sorry. I'm thinking of um, Operation Raccoon City. My bad. My bad. That is such an odd game to be canon. I don't understand. Come on, come on, come on. Last is tackle, last is tackle. Grimer, Grimer, don't do this to me. Eat it, Ilma. I swear it rigs the matchmaking against you. Sup, folks? L1 Metal Gaming. Wait, what is the meaning of this? Panayati, Athena, L1 Metal Gaming. What happened? You didn't say what is the meaning of this, so I have to say it for you. L1. But how's it going, bro? How you doing? Aqua Jet? Wait, who's trying to learn Aqua Jet? Popes! The Popes is ready! We're gonna remove Pound. We're gonna get our Beast of a Pope Leo ready to go. <laughs> I just played some of the Battlefront camp. How is it, dude? How is it? Aside the, aside from all the all the drama that that this game has gone under over the last week... Um, over my microtransactions. How is the actual game? <laughs> you or I, or should I say you and your Pokemon make quite the interesting team? I do hope you come to Verdant Cavern and attempt the trial, the trial of Ilma. If I had more hair, it would flip back and there'd be a shine to it, and it'd go ding. <laughs> you can get there from Route Two. That Rotom Dex of yours will show you the way. I bid you, Alola. Um, yay, we did it. Now, question. There was a couple here that gave us an item. Are they still here? Like in Poke... Yes, they are. X defense. Here we go. Boom. Ooh, there's a sticker behind there, too. We officially have a like from Guru on the tweet. Hope he remains high. That Make this happen. Yo, Ribo, if you make this happen, you are the best around. No one's ever gonna live you now. You've collected three totem stickers. So, question on the totem stickers. Does it indicate when you actually have collected them all? Because I'm going to be going crazy looking for all these things, if that's the case. So those of you wondering what what, uh, what Ripo and I are talking about, um, there was a tweet between Nintendtalk and, um, and Nintendo Guru talking smack at each other about ARMS. And I suggested over on the uh, doing, as part of the Extra Life livestream, doing commentary over their matchup. For, our, for an arms match. We can do like a best out of three or something like that. And I'll do my commentary impersonating J JR Jim Ross. And this will be on top of... Oh damn, I'm finding stickers left and right. This will be on top of the epic battle that will happen between myself and Guru in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. <clears throat> Wasn't there another sticker on here? Or am I making things up? Thought I saw another sticker earlier. I guess uh, I guess not. Oh, there is a sticker in there. There's a sparkling sticker. Perhaps you can snag it with a fishing rod. Which I don't have a fishing rod. Crappies. Oop. Dude, how many totem stickers are there? So when am I carrying you in Rocket League? Yo. <laughs> We're gonna be playing Pokemon for a while. I have no idea when 
when we'll be able to actually play a game of Rocket League. This was the problem, man. It was like so many games that came out. I was just like, are you kidding me right now? When the hell am I going to have time to play any of this? And then I go and pick up the ones that I said I wasn't going to pick up. I have a problem, guys. I have a real problem. All right, so there's one so far that I can't get because I don't have a fishing rod, but I feel like we get the fishing rod before we leave this island, like the old rod or whatever. No? I'm a child goer. Heal ball, that's nice. All right. <laughs> I noticed, <laughs> I know, right? I'm like, dang. But yeah, we have a ton of Nintendo Spikes go. Oh, by the way, question for everyone in the chat. I mentioned this last time, but I didn't get any answers. So, Batman The Telltale Series came out on Switch. It's the first season, um, the first five episodes. What do you guys think, if we do do a playthrough of it, how's this idea of us doing an episode a week? Excuse me. Like, treat it like an actual TV series, where we would do one episode every week. Um, granted, we won't be able to cool do the cool thing where everyone could download the app and play the game together, which I thought would have been amazing to do. But um, but yeah, I would, I would definitely like to give that a shot if you guys are if there's interest in it. See, there was the police station that I didn't get to go into yet. Right? Oh boy. Don't beat me up, Machump. Here's some advice, trainer. If you're going to stand up to tough opponents. Alright. Episode a week can be fun. That way, you know, it's not like overbearing. We're not just sitting here all quiet like, what's happening next? What's happening next? So it's like... We can, we can, we can take it in spurts. Because you figure it'd probably be like two hours an episode or something like that. So we'd be able to beat it in five weeks. No police car there. I mean, no sticker there <laughs> behind the police car is what I meant to say. Uh, I'm guessing the stickers are only going to be outside. Is that a safe assumption? I don't see him around there. Do you know... Officially, if it supports a mobile app, I don't think so. I don't even see it because when it did, didn't they like show it on the thingy? That would be awesome if it did, though. I would freaking love that. Um, before we go to go on to Route Two, I'm just double checking for stickers now. There we go. Boom. stickers do I need? Oh, no. Didn't want to do that. Let me sneak into your house and place the sticker. <laughs> oh, my God. But, yeah. Question for you guys. If... Does it, does it tell you um, when you've collected all of them? Like, it, does it at least give you an indication? Oh, wait for me, Joey. Where'd you pop from? Oh, I'm glad to see a familiar face. I get so lost so quickly. I can't figure out the roads here. I can't even buy my own clothes. But you... You're moving on to your first trial? You're going... You're going to Verdant Cavern? I read something in an old book once. It said that the challenge, the island challenges were once a journey made to prove yourself and gain the strength to battle against the guardian deities of Alola, like Tapu Koko. The people in Iki Town said that that Tapu Koko loves Pokemon battles, didn't they? If we can meet Tapu Koko once more, do you think we'd be able to find the answer of why, to why it saved you and Nebby that day? Oh yes, please take these. They're called revives. If you use one one on a Pokemon after they have fainted, it will receive. It'll revive the Pokemon. That's what it comes down to. Yo, Fod, what is going on, dude? 
Back from work, Brenna Mayhem? Or were you working today? I forget. I think I'm thinking Simtir. Simtir was working today. I forget. I forget. Good luck on your first trial. I hope that it goes well for you. Oh boy. There, Joey. I've got this ornery creature calmed again for now. Want to try giving him a little pet again? That's the only way he'll get used to you. Come on, Joey. Try, try showing Toros a bit of affection. Poke the nose, touch its forelegs, grab it by the... Poke its nose? I don't even remember that as an option. Hmm, Taurus didn't seem to care for that. Touch its forelegs, grab it by the horn- I'm- Touch- Really? I gotta grab it by the horns? I don't remember that. <laughs> okay. Maybe old Taurus here can feel your love for Pokemon. He sure seems happy to know you, and yet, it still seems like- It seems to me like Taurus wants to stretch his legs out on his own island challenge. Huh! Uh, what? You want to play tag now? The Melee Melee Kaluna never loses, Fred. Whoa, what is happening here? 